So like I mentioned guys, I'm going to be sharing with you all the stuff that I have received um, in order to start my nail room the organization. The first thing to arrive was, I'm not sure, so we're going to look at this together. I have a feeling, yes, so this is my studio lighting, um, like I mentioned in one of my stories, um, my light bulb broke, and let's see what else came in. Uh, oh, a nail clipper, I'm very excited about this because I can't believe, well I have been out of the nail game for quite a long time, so that is why I have not uh, heard or seen these before. Um, oh. I hope it's not broken. Allegedly, it's one of those nail clippers. Wow. There goes that piece. Yeah, so it's a, a regular nail clipper. Oh, I like how it feels, though. I can't seem to finish a sentence. So it's one of the regular nail clippers. However, it has this attachment um, that somehow attaches on here. Ooh, I think it's not a good working one. Because allegedly you attach it here and then you turn it and all of these grooves that you see here is like a marker to predetermine the length so that way they're all uniform and not like some are longer and less time. Then I have to spend less time in filing and all that. So And then here is I think where they all fall, you know, to catch them so they're not flying all over the place and you're not poking somebody's eyes out. So I think... Yeah, it has the numbers to so like 0, 1, 2, 3, and so on. And so for the length. So I guess like that would be like the longer one and whatnot. But yeah, can't wait to try this on my next set. And see, I, recently I've been sporting short length nails because of my work. But I can't wait to try this on. Or try this. But yes, this. I've also been very excited to try to use these stork uh, stork nails or stork scissors um, because these would help for like even shaping the nail tip like if I want a tapered square I could just use these to cut out so if you guys want a full-on review I am more than happy to but so I'm just like, I know I look horrible right now but I just had to I'm so excited so you know how I told you guys that I'm waiting for a few stuff to get into uh, like from Amazon and allegedly I wasn't gonna get these until the next week until Monday today for reference is Thursday and I just got a notification from Amazon saying that it's out for delivery today oh my gosh I'm so excited guys I'm so excited I think that right there is my Amazon order which I'm surprised they sent it through UPS yes it is Ooh, and it's my UPS guy mm -hmm. okay I'm gonna put my jacket and go get it and I think it's a heavy one hopefully I can I can actually carry it okay let's go see oh, there she is okay yeah she is heavy I don't think I'm gonna be able to move this I do believe that was the cardio for the day. Wow. I can't believe I did it. So, I got something to do tonight. Put that thing together. So then I will show you guys exactly how um, how it is now. And then how I have, have it all set up afterwards. Because like I said, this is, it's time for an upgrade. It, does, it has done the trick for many years. Uh, but I think it's now time because things are not very easily accessible. Like... It's two tiers right here of like my some acrylics and then some polishes up here and just having to it's, it's just not it's not functional but it does the trick so I'm thankful for where I started and I'm thankful for where I'm going so okay so this is so far what I'm seeing and I am 
currently liking. Um, it has these little nice plastic bumpers or corner bumpers and then on all four corners and it does have styrofoam. I still need to open up and inspect each individual panel. I do see they have um, an instruction packet which a lot of people were saying that it did not come with instructions so hopefully this will come in handy and I won't be struggling too much. Uh, but here goes nothing. And I notice it does have these little stickers with a number three. Uh, keep a lookout for them uh, because a lot of people were saying that it had no letters, it had numbers, they couldn't tell what part was what. I think you just got to pay attention. But I'm going to still keep going through each and every part. I can't get ahead of myself because watch that one just be a coincidence. But uh, yeah, see they all have, like it's, they seem to have numbers. Like that's number 11. There's like a lot of these so... I'm so excited but nervous and scared. Okay guys, so this is where I'm at right now. Um, I did want to take the time to show this to you guys. The little rails where the drawers hook up. Make sure, and I hope you can tell because my lighting is not very good right now. There you go. You make sure you look inside the rails because it'll have some engravings. And sometimes it's very noticeable like here. Other times you can hardly hardly tell so look up for that because that's how you tell the the railings apart because guys bye. so I just now finished building this little organizer I started around 5 15 5 20 in the afternoon it is 10 30 in the evening I still gotta pick up all this stuff but um Oh, and then I, you know, nothing can go perfect. Um, I, I couldn't go without a hitch, right? So this platform, the top part of the cabinet, is actually what's supposed to be on the bottom because this right here is for the wheels. But since I'm not putting the wheels, and it doesn't really matter, it's just that I'm going to have to deal with these, like, holes on the corner. I might find something to put on there. Hopefully what I put on there, it'll cover it up. Uh, I, I really don't feel like setting all of this up again but uh, the drawers are here um, I need to clean up like take away the stickers that tell you the parts of each number or whatever um, but I need to um, just organize everything the drawers are here they're pretty good they do roll out easily um, there's like this much of a gap that you know behind that it doesn't open all the way I wish it would open a little bit more but that's fine that's okay um, I'm gonna start I don't think I'll start putting stuff in tonight because it is kind of late oh that's weird didn't go in very easily but <sighs> seems to be good yeah I think it's doable it's just um like you could do it on your own. I did it on my own and I suffer for with chronic back problems, chronic pains, um, and I was able to do it. So I'm pretty sure you can do it too. Just keep in mind, it did take me like four hours or more. Uh, well, from 5.15 to 10.30. Um, so it did take a while. Uh, but just pay attention to the parts and follow the directions. I found the instructions actually pretty clear. Uh, this is the little bag that I'm keeping with all the instructions. I'm gonna link this in the bot in the in the um the description box if you guys are interested in getting this. And then if you guys wanna see me, if you guys wanna see me go uh, and put everything and set everything up, let me know and I'll be more than happy to do a video. But anyways, as you can hear, I am super tired, so I'm going to call it a night. Um, if you guys are interested in seeing how I organize everything, leave a comment below. Subscribe if you haven't done so. Give me a like. And if you guys want to purchase this thing on Amazon, I'll go ahead and link it at the bottom. Alright, so have a good night, good day, good afternoon, whenever you're watching this. And I'll see you at the next one.